Hey everybody, how you doing? It's Bruce here, Stock Markets with Bruce. Welcome back to the final hour of trading for September the 3rd, Friday, September the 3rd. Uh, we are getting ready to finish off the week. Uh, I don't think we're complaining uh, over the big picture, I suppose. Uh, every uh, it, Certain stocks are doing better than others. Some, some stocks are not participating as much as we'd like, but I don't think we can really complain about the big picture. We'll look at what's happening on some of our stocks here. Rocket Lab is um, on fire. I'll give you that. It's up 250 a share here at 1414 for Rocket Lab. Uh, the volume today, 7.9 million. Pretty good. Um, shares actually opened down on the day, down to 1101. They were they were underwater this morning, and then they recovered around the 10 in the morning mark. By 11 in the morning, uh, we got the shares to about a high of about what was that 1341, and then they came back to about 1250 or 1240. So they went up to 1340, down to 1240, and that was 1130, and a steady march ever since. But in the last 30 minutes, an absolute climb to the top of Mount Everest here looking at the chart on the rocket level i'll show you the chart here on my phone you can see here this uh, shot right here in the last 30 40 minutes we have really taken off now at 1422 of 259 uh, just about the high of the day here quite a run extraordinary no news um i just think what we have is market awareness we've got the spacex companies out there um these guys have been delivering the successful launch after successful launch they have a backlog of orders. They have a bunch of money in the bank. So there you go. They're they're up 266, 267 right now, 1430 on Rocket Lab right now as it continues to climb. Very, very good day. Um, SoFi uh, holding a gain of 16 cents. All day uh, we've been uh, kind of hanging around this, uh, the, the lowest this morning, 1492. That didn't last more than 20 minutes. We were really sitting more around the... Uh, Oh, 1520 range. We got as high as 1553, and then we backed off to 1514 just after lunch today. And here we are, 1522, up 16 cents, 16 million shares. Another up day, but not the leader. But you know, it's another up day. We'll, we'll take it. Um, GameStop um, is coming back from a bit of a dip here. We reached the low at about 145 today, not 198.84 for a moment. It had like a half hour, zzz, and then a comeback. We're now from 198.84. We're at 203.94. That's about five dollars ten cents better. Still down 972 on the day, but only 2.1 million volume. This actually is encouraging. Um, if this stock were down 972 right now on 20 million shares, I'd be worried, or on five and a half or six million shares. But 2.1 million? No, no. You could say, if you're a pessimist, well, Bruce, uh, how come there's no buying? How come there's, you know, uh, there's just no, you know, support on the stock right now? Um, I'll grant you that. Uh, it could be some shorters trying to take advantage of this uh, little drop, but they couldn't get it under 198.84. It snapped back quickly. So now here we are. We're about, we're about five bucks better off. We'll see how this works out the rest of the day. Coming into a long weekend, too, we'll see. Uh, Matterport. Um, now at the high, about the high of the day, um, it is threat, threatening eighteen dollars a share. Seventeen ninety two at this moment in time, touched eighteen twelve already. It got to seventeen ninety nine ninety eight or something. It backed off a bit, then broke through eighteen. Now at eighteen, back to eighteen again. We're up sixty five cents. Three million shares on Matterport, up sixty five cents. It's a great looking day, but compared to uh, uh, Rocket Lab, it looks anemic. It looks like nothing's happening. So. <laughs> It's all perception, but it is a good day today. We're on top of the gains yesterday. Matterport right now, as a matter of fact, is at the highest level uh, in over six months. The last time this stock was higher than this was February, March. Uh, and that was when this deal was announced uh, to, to actually put this Matterport deal together. And the stock went too far too quick. Uh, but here we are, $17.94 to $18, uh, looking good right here. 23andMe is not participating in a rally, but it's only off four cents. 885 would be lovely to see a two dollar pop here. Sooner or later, we have noticed and have heard today from some viewers of ours that uh, option activity looks very strong right now. Very heavy option option activity going on. 
So maybe there's some, some anticipation of uh, movement coming up in the next few weeks. Smart rent, a uh, good day here, up a dollar forty to thirteen eighty nine. Um, this stock is uh, approaching uh, all time high fifteen fourteen. Uh, that is its all time high today. It did touch fourteen ninety three at about eleven o'clock. It went way too far too fast. There was just nothing for sale. Finally, some stocks showed up and it came back from this fourteen ninety three level back to about thirteen forty nine. So maybe a buck fifty lower. Now we're 1390 again, so we're back up 50 cents from the low this afternoon, gaining 140 on the day on 621,000 shares. Another big winner, Spire Global. Uh, Spire uh, this morning was uh, sitting around um, 9, let's see if I can see this, 920, 915, 911. So it lasted there for about an hour and then began a climb. The low of the day, 911, uh, began to climb peaked at about 12.30 this afternoon. I thought, oh, maybe that's it, 10.70 or so. Backed off to like 10.40, but flatlined for a while, and now 11.33. Took a shot about a half an hour ago. Uh, went from about, um, looks like about 10.60, right up to the high of the day, 11.77. So a 90 cent shot in 15 minutes, and we're holding here at 11.33, up 2.15 on 531,000 shares. We finally have some volume. We were barely at a couple hundred thousand the last time I talked to you, so we got a little more, but still light trading, but boy, a big move. Uh, ATIP is down a nickel. It has a range today of 442 to 455, so 13 cent range. It's a nothing burger today. We're, we're, we're down a nickel. There's nothing going on. Um, and Sextera, we're up a dime on that one. We were as low as um, 865 today, so... You know, from 9.12 last night to 8.65, uh, and then uh, reached 9.30 just a few moments ago. We're at 9.22 right now. We're up a dime on 133,000 volume. I have no news on it. I have no news on ATIP today, by the way. People are wondering, what you know, what do I think? ATIP, we're waiting for the company to announce their new CEO. Kind of wondering if that's coming next week. Thinking in my mind that you might as well release new news on a new manager, you know, take over the control of the company after Labor Day. Because before Labor Day, there's nobody here. It's the end of summer. Start next week or, you know, something like that. Maybe that's in the plans. I have no I have no official guarantee that that's what's going on. But that would be I, the way I would do it. Uh, but we'll see what these guys are going to do next week. 448 on ATIP, 992, 922 on Sextero. Uh, AMC is down 89 cents, uh, so it's under pressure as well. GameStop's still down 956. Uh, Robinhood down 84 cents. Now, Vanek Vector's up 245. Home Depot up 264. They've had a nice uh, uh, pop up here, holding very steadily. IBM is down 19 cents. It's been down almost all day, but just barely. 139.82. The Dow down 25 points. Negative territory virtually all day today for the Dow, but it's only off 24 points. This is a nothing burger. We got a three point gain on SP. Nothing burger. And we got NASDAQ up 35 points, a fifth of a percentage point. Dead quiet, or it's a, it's a Friday for a long weekend. This is what we're getting. Um, Microsoft up 70 cents, uh, Apple up 45, Tesla down 462, Bed Bath & Beyond down 32 cents, BlackBerry down 19, Royal Caribbean dropping, uh, down 357 on Royal Caribbean to 79.35. Those of you who have been picking up put contracts this week, while the stock's been in this 81 to 82 neighborhood. You're getting your reward now. Uh, the stock has backed off here and uh, is now down. It was as low as 78.68. It's now 79.34. It's not recovering very well. So maybe, maybe more droppage coming there. Uh, the news out of Florida is terrible. It's just terrible. Uh, I don't care what you say if you're a Floridian. Whatever you think is going on in Florida, great. But from the outside looking in, it's awful. It is just awful uh tourists are going to avoid florida at all costs this winter uh not every single last one of us but a whole bunch of people are not coming uh it's too dangerous too shaky uh too loosey-goosey uh fights between politicians and doctors people are going don't need this crap i just don't need this crap i think i'll avoid it that's that's what i see happening there but you know 
Goldman Sachs down 321 to 411. That's a $700 stock next year. Uh, still on sale. Limited time offer. Amazon up 470. Facebook up $1.30. Alphabet up 1895. Uh, JP Morgan down 55 cents. So there you have it. That's kind of the latest on some of the stocks we follow the most. 1410 on Rocket Lab right now up 247. SoFi 1522 up 15 cents. GameStop down 971 a share at 203.81. Matterport 1792 up 57 cents. ME down only a penny, trying to come into the positive. Smart Rent 1391 up a dollar 42, and Spire 1134 up 222. 1140 now up 222 on Spire. That is pushing uh, 37 cents from the high of the day. 543,000 looks like it wants to go higher yet. Very interesting start to this uh, final hour of trading here. Um, Watching out of Creston, British Columbia. Wow, what a what a run! What can I say? Uh, uh, nephew Nick, hey Uncle Bruce, which is better, a big one day run up or a series of consistent smaller positive days? Uh, you know what I like is I, I like the one day run up. <laughs> I don't mind a couple small days. I, I never mind them, never. But a one day run up, I love because that is a wake up call. That's like a slap across the face. Wake up! It's like a share slapping that guy in that movie Moonstrike. Moonstruck. Wake up! Uh, it's a wake up call. And uh, Rocket Lab is shaking up uh, the markets here. Uh, 23, uh, sorry, um, uh, Matterport this week has woken people up. Now we're seeing Smart Rent and Spire wake people up. This is great. This is what you want. This is putting their stocks on the on the awareness map. People wondering, well, what are these guys all about? Why their stock? Why is their stock up so much? Uh, you know, why is Spire up almost twenty percent today? Why is Smart Rent uh, almost up but uh, ten percent today? What, what's going on? Yeah, we're waking people up, and uh, you, you get put on the, the the biggest winners and losers. You get on the winners chart. You wake people up in a good way, and then give me consistent movement like today. So far, twenty cents. I'll take that. Yeah, give me 20, 30 cent uh, gains every day, all week long. I'll take that. I can live with that. Very comfortable. Matterport up 53. I like this. Uh, anyway, there you go, folks. Uh, it's uh, looking good, and uh, we'll take it. Uh, fantastic. Anyway, yeah, we'll do what we can here. Uh, keep on top of this market. Don't forget Spire Bruce. Uh, 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 Royal Crim is being very nice to me right now. There you go, SVT. It's going a lot lower than this. Oh, my God, it's green. 100% gain on my Rocket Lab call. Oh, my God. Uh, these got, these stocks are going higher. Uh, don't think that any of them are topping out right now, that this is as good as it's ever going to be. These are early days. Uh, these companies are still completely unknown in the big picture. Uh, but you get moves like this coming along here with steady increases. Uh, you build awareness and momentum. Momentum begats momentum. So there you are, 1410 on Rocket Lab, up 247 right now. The high today, 1434. Not bad. Uh, Matterport, 1790. Uh, ME just went positive, 890 for 23. ME just went green. Will it hold? I don't know. Smart Rent, uh, 1390. Uh, trying to get to the 14 level again. It looks like it's going to the way it's going here. And we've got uh, a, a, we got Spire, 1140 up 222. 11.77 high of the day, uh, 11.55 right now, just jumped to 11.55, 22 cents away from the high of the day. So Spire looks like it wants to go higher too. Very good, uh, very, very good stuff. I like this, Sixtera up 7 cents to 9.19. I'd like to see Sixtera over 10 get into that 11.12 range and begin its assault on greatness for us as well. ATIP, just bring on the new CEO. Uh, tell us your plan, and let's see what happens uh, uh, I, I'm cutting them a break. Let's see what gives. All right, there it is, guys. Fun, fun, fun. Uh, hey, Bruce, I have 16, 12 and a half uh, strike November 19th uh, Spire calls. I bought them at 61 cents, and they're sitting around 115 right now. Take some profit or hold. I don't want to be slaughtered. I think you sit around. Uh, Spire is just coming around. I mean, it's 11.55. It was underwritten at 10. The deal was done at 10. This is not. This is a nothing burger. We haven't even started yet. So uh, you've got November. Uh, give it all next week. It's a short week next week. Let's give it next week and the week after. See what what happens, and then decide. But uh, you know, another buck or two on this thing, and you got yourself a thirteen fifty market 
with a twelve and a half dollar call, you're looking at two dollar contracts, maybe two twenty fives, two fifties. You four times your money. Now you can look at rollovers. There's all kinds of opportunity here. But right now, it's uh, just let her ride, let her ride, baby, and get out of its way. Uh, too bad most of my money is M E A T I and six air. But man, I am enjoying the color of my one rocket lap call and my one S Spire call and six Matterports. That's good too. It, it, this is the beginning of the beginning. We hope. Number four, Uncle Bruce, why didn't you tell me to buy Rocket Lab? Um, I, I was waiting for you. Like when I saw you come on the air, I, I knew I'm not going to say anything about Rocket Lab. As soon as I saw you go off the air, I told everybody else. And I told them not to tell you. I told them just to keep it to yourself. Don't let number four know because he, you know, troublemaker. Uh, attitude. Uh, maybe that's what it is. <laughs> Six there just went green. Wooey! Aspire, Rocket Lab, Matterport, popping off. Who's going to sacrifice the goat for ME and XCYXT? Just, just give them time. Just give them time. They'll all come around. They'll all take care of you. All right. Uh, where are the thumbs ups for Bruce? Uh, don't forget to give this guy some thumbs ups. How many got? I got 97 thumbs ups. What am I complaining about? I have 315 people here. I've got 97 thumbs ups. That's like one of every three of you who are making all kinds of money are throwing me a thumbs up. That, that's a pretty good batting average, a 333 batting average. If I were a baseball player, I'd be getting millions of dollars for that batting average. I can't complain. But now you're ruining it all. You're, you're 111 thumbs ups. You're coming in and giving me the love. You guys, uh, 122, thank you. Oh, what can I say? I, okay, I'll take the thumbs up. <laughs> Hey, I'm talking about smart. Uh, talking about smart. Is Rob here? I would like to thank you for the put before noon today. It's green and greener now. I hear Jen. She's back. And oh, she's packing. All right. Oh, it's a one-way street. We're out of here. And uh, the packing is on, baby. The kitchen is being packed up big time. Yeah, <clears throat> that's what's going on. Anyway, hey, Uncle Bruce, I sold my SoFi $14 calls today. Would it be smart to then buy an in-the-money call for Matterport expiring maybe September 17th? I already have a long call on Matterport January 22. Um, I, I would not be buying in-the-money in short calls on any of these stocks. I just wouldn't be doing that. You, you're, you're just better off to position yourself long term. If, you, if you've got some extra cash right now, why don't you buy some long uh, maybe Apple contracts. Get get some Apple. Uh, get your hands on something long term like a long term Goldman Sachs call. Uh, diversify into some of this stuff. Uh, um, spread your wings a little bit. Or that's what I'd look at. Or just buy up some of the uh, um, ATIP stock at four something a share. Just gobble this stuff up while it's still down here because once they come up with their their news at 450 a share once they come up with their news as to who their new ceo is this thing could pop the fuck or two right off the get-go and uh, you'll even make more money but up to you uh you, you, your your call of course it's always your call it's your deal um but i'm glad to see you've got some money to play around with this is good stuff uh we're we're thinking of you as so far um uh, i feel like gene uh, when i read your comments um let's see uh, let's go here. Uh, maybe ME decided to join the party better late than ever, I guess. We'll, we'll take them. Come on in. You're always welcome. Throw 23 and me. Uncle Bruce, it uh, looks like I missed the boat to roll over my 917-180 uh, covered calls before GameStop earnings. So I plan to wait and see what happens on Tuesday, but should I roll over before earnings no matter what? Um, well, you know, uh, the shares did dip to 190, whatever, and now here we are at 203, almost 204. Um, you might do the rollover on Tuesday. You might find that if the shares have a little run into the 2, 10, 15, 20 range, if they want to do that, you might do a rollover then. You can always do a rollover here. Uh, you know, can always do it, but um, I, I would wait, I guess, now. Let's, let, let's see what happens on Tuesday morning. Um, uh, that's the beauty of rollovers is that uh, they can be done at any time whether the shares are higher or lower. Uh, that's just it. Uh, you've got now till next weekend, right? Uh, or the weekend after that. So you got time to figure it out. Well, we'll see how this stock wants to perform. It's 204, Noah. 204 now on the GameStop at the moment. Matterport 1798. Uh, Smart Rent 1385. Spider, uh, Spire Global 1165 of 247. All right, there we go. Um, laugh a lot. Thanks, Deb. Uh, Rocket Lab Matterport have been real winners for me today. Hi, Uncle Bruce from Bill. Hey, Bill, how you doing, man? Uncle Bruce was able to convince my wife. Uh, uh, I was able to convince my wife. 
<laughs> to bong a beer if SoFi hits $16. The idea of the mother of my daughter bonging a bush light in a sundress was epic. I will try again at a later date. We got close. Uh, well, you know, we, we, we do the best we can. Uh, we hope for the best. 1527. Uh, doesn't look likely that's going to hit 16 today, does it? I think this is the greenest day I've ever had. Thanks, Uncle B. Island Girl, I'm happy for you. I think it's the greenest day I've ever had. Beautiful. Um, MTTR, Matterport for me, too. Uh, theme song today, Rocket Man, says that. AB, laugh out. We were talking for months. When is VACQ, Rocket Lab, going to have options? And there you go. DraftKing, new member. Welcome, DraftKing, to the channel. Nice to have a new member join today. It's great. Love you guys. Uh, new members, fantastic. Uncle Bruce, your sarcasm makes me laugh. Uh, neat, neat, neat. Love it. Why didn't you tell me? Why didn't you tell me? Um, uh, I, only, I guess you don't have much uh, game stuff in your portfolio. Brutal day, week before earnings. Um, what else we got? Michael, uh, AB, uh, Pepperidge Farm remembers. Um, ride side by side. Does anyone know why Spire is running? Does anyone know why? Uh, they've been signing up contracts lately, uh, like uh, the the National Oceanic uh, contract, and they signed another contract with the European Space Agency, and they're just they're just picking up contracts. Work, work, work. They're growing. Uh, they're a happening thing. They're sitting on a lot of cash. Uh, they're in pretty good shape here. Um, yes, Steb, Rocket Lab, burning up, uh, burning out its fuse up there alone. Um, Splair, are you the the one from the morning show who mentioned their birthday is on Monday, September the 6th? And I think it's going to be a long, long flight. Um, a green, I'd roll over your SoFi calls. Uh, at the end of this show, uh, Jan's hand will appear. Grab Uncle Bruce and stuff him in a box. <laughs> Thank you so much, Sela. Is saying I rolled my September 10, 175 GameStop covered call into a January 21, 230 covered call, while GameStop was at 215 today. Uh, bought in an extra eight bucks a share, and my account is green again. Beautiful, and of course the shares backed off, so those contracts are lower, and so there you have it. You're you're in good shape. Uh, you know, Bruce is so over trying to pronounce names. You know that, he. Eh? <laughs> Fennevel, I had six shares um, uh, of GameStop. I sold three when the stock went above 300 in the spring. I'm just going to write out the last three and see where it goes. Uh, Sela, I feel embarrassed, but I'm not totally understanding the whole rollover concept. Uh, well, that's what my classes are for. You want to watch my option classes. Uh, we're... Uh, uh, you know, I'm trying to cover all these different topics about options, how complicated this can be and how complex, but I try to do it in a plain English format. So head to the website, uh, traveling with uh, stockmarketswithbruce.ca, stockmarketswithbruce.ca, and check it out. Note Spire up 318 a share right now at 1236. Spire at 1236, which is approaching its all time high. As a matter of fact, it hit its all time high just a few minutes ago of 1284. Never been above 1284. We're at our high right a moment or two ago. We're at 1242 right now. 761,000 uh, shares. Beautiful spire hitting new all time highs. Smart rent up a dollar 62 to 1411. The all time high for smart rent has been 1514. That was uh, almost hit this morning at 1493. We're at 1411 right now. Coming on again. Matterport 1794. Trying to get back to $18. So far. Hanging around 1526, Rocket Lab 1407 up 244. Get used to this uh, going forward. Get used to some of your stocks going up a buck, some going up two bucks, some might start going up three bucks. Just get ready. Uh, do not be shocked when it begins. I've been telling you this for months. When it happens, it will not wait for you. It will go. GameStop being pushed down to me. Uh, to me, a good sign. Someone is scared and needs to take action to keep the price down before earnings release. Well, may maybe that's it. 204.34 on GameStop. AB, if Rocket Lab hits 15, I'm going to scream. <laughs> Nephew Nick, um, Cela Green, you take your current SoFi proceeds and buy further out SoFi calls. Not saying what to do, but it seems like SoFi could take off with the bank charter, which could come this month, and that's what we're waiting for, the bank charter. 15.30 on SoFi. Poor man member signing in. Uh, welcome, Draft King. I hope you're going to get richer watching these stocks here and getting into these. Spire 1250. Yeah, what can I say? Spire 1250 up 332 right now. 
Uh, rockin' and rockin' and rockin'. All right, uh, Matterport option jumped to hundred dollars today. What happened to the troll? Spire is popping. Uncle Bruce, my plan of buying one hundred GameStop. Uh, where's this comment? Uh, one hundred GameStop and writing a covered call for two hundred dollars strike for next week is in motion now. Was able to buy at one ninety nine and now waiting to sell a covered call. There you right on. There you go. Uh, Mike, uh, can we see 13? A DM had uh, 10 November Spire calls for my sister, and they just got gobbled up for double what I paid. Nice call, Bruce. Nice, nice, nice. Nice call. Thank you, guys. Uh, whoa, Spire. Uh, nephew Nick, so I already have a long call on SoFi expiring. Maybe I just add on to that. Hmm? Thank you so much for explaining that to me. I really appreciate it. Uh, where are we at now? Spire, 1240 up 322. Smart Rent, uh, 1416 up $1. sixty-eight. Matterport, 1792 up 57 cents. SoFi, 1528 up 22. Rocket Lab, up 250 to 1413. GameStop, down 928 at 204.24. Oh my God, Spire just went to 1260. Reading some comments behind here. Uh, everything is underwater, so all stonks that have to do with water at some point will moon. Simple. Spire got my calls cooking. Uh, I pet my neighbor's dog that he asked if he could get it to stop dropping ATIP in my yard. <laughs> you were supposed to sing that, Bruce. Uh, <laughs> aspiring January, uh, expiring January 22. Sorry, nephew Nick, but it's 2250. May I buy one in the money? I need that. What happened to Rocket Lab Inspire to happen to ME? We need Jen to get one of those stage hooks from the old Bugs Bunny cartoons and just yank them away. Uh, it's the seventh Tuesday. Why, why are you asking? It's the seventh on Tuesday. DM, uh, $10, that's for Spire. Thank you for the uh, donation, DM. I do appreciate it. Uh, I love it when you guys make money. I do, I do. Um, uh, flash Infection, Flash Infection, can we get the story behind your name? Uh, Drops Family Garden, Rocket Lab, and Matterport. Zoom, zoom, thanks for those picks. Uncle B, you betcha, kids. Seal Green, no problem. Oh, yeah, if you already have SoFi, it might be good to wait or diversify into another stock, but I'm in SoFi, and it looks strong to me. It's an ATM. Uh, Draft King, please don't leave any comments up on your screen. Uh, I think I will take a look at Spire. Uh, Gaiotti, I think we should hold our Spire 22 contracts. I have them at $10 strike. Nice. $12.28 right now on Spire. Uh, wow, what a run here. ATIP is unchanged now. It's come back. Uh, we're at 35 minutes to go. ATIP is flat. Four fifty-two a share. Uh, Sextera up seven cents. Spire up three thirteen to twelve thirty-one. Smart Rent up a buck eighty-eight. Fourteen thirty-seven. We've got. Uh, hang on a second here. We can get this done here. Uh, there we go. We've got. Uh, we've got. Uh, where am I? Smart Rent up a buck ninety-one. Uh, Twenty-three me up a penny. Matterport up fifty-two to eight seventeen eighty-seven. GameStop still down nine twenty-three. SoFi up nineteen and Rocket Lab fourteen oh four up two forty-one. What a day today. We are powering up here, uh, looking really good. IBM, the heartbreaker, down 30 cents. Uh, what can I say about that? Not much, I guess. Uh, there's not much I can say. Anyway, there you have it, kids. Um, Anti PC is laughing. Nephew Nick, thanks. Uh, go very so very much. If only I had more money to invest, says Pickle. Um, Pick knows. Uh, damn, really testing my patience now. Definitely feeling the urge to roll uh, in the money. November Spire calls out. Uh, well, they are uh, they are looking good, aren't they? Um, and that stock just keeps on chucking. Twelve thirty nine up three twenty nine, three twenty one. Excuse me. A B. Uh, if 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 uh, if it did this every day for a month, I'd be in a position to ask you if I can retire, <laughs> yoloing hundred grand into Goldman options for April and June. <laughs> if only would do that. Right side by side. Thank you for Rocket Lab and Spire. Thank you for the donation. I appreciate it, guys. Keeps us alive here. The moving fund is coming along. Uh, damn it, Bruce, so far should be up 325, not Spire. Well, you know, they'll both go up, maybe one today, one tomorrow. This has been a fun day, says Bomba Babe. I bet you it has been. I see a lot of thumbs. Good day for growth stocks, says Mike. Uh, see you, I'm no expert, just thinking what I'll do. Uh, flesh infection, um, uh, May 11th, 1998, there was an accident in the basement lab. Virus broke out. Fever gone, but itchy, hungry, so eat brains. Itchy, itchy, tasty. Where did the name come from? Just in case you want to know. David, uh, Uncle Bruce, I'm up over 60% on my January 22 Matterport calls. What is your opinion of taking profits and rolling out longer? Uh, just sit tight. Just just sit tight. You, have, you haven't even started yet. Uh, you, you're now finally getting some reward. You got till January here. You want another couple of weeks. Uh, this stock could be, you know, 1792 now. Maybe it's 18 to 20 next week. 
Um, you know, get well into the money. Get good and green. Let the don't let don't get in the way of the market. Just enjoy a profit. Yeah, and run it, run it, run it. Sorry, my twelve fifty Matterport twenty two calls. Uh, that nice job you got. You're at you're in the money here now. Obviously, uh, uh, five something bucks. Uh, uh, you you probably got a couple more coming your way. Um, you're probably going to have yourself a twenty dollars stock in the not too distant future. You're going to be sitting on seven fifty book value plus premium, so you're going to be what eight fifty nine dollars a contract, and um, you know maybe then from there you know. But anytime you feel that you feel the need to roll over, you, you're able, able to do it. But these are going higher. Uh, these stocks are all going higher. Uh, nice. Um, let's keep going here. My name is Jonas. If that rain continues, you better go long on Royal Caribbean. It will be. Um, Ark Noah of stocks. <laughs> um, AD, uh, Stevie, Steve was very lucky, but I think he was cheating. What a scumbag. All right, SVT Boxer. Oh, my God. Look at that. $50 donation from SVT Boxer. Thank you so much. I just killed on Spire calls. I love you, Uncle B. I love it when someone does that. I, I love it when you guys can cash in a good one. Fantastic. Not even a lot of volume on Spire. It's true. Hey, Uncle Bruce, picked up a $6 strike BBIG put. Um, 924 think I have it enough time to, to gas out uh, thanks uh, I don't know I uh, you know I'm, I'm just not following that stock at all so I, you know you're on your own on this one but you've seen the pattern haven't you and uh, there you go Splare, my birthday is September 6th yes island girl uh, that's it uh, flesh infection AB uh, Fenneville SVT boxer congrats um, YOLO thanks Fenneville uh, those tw January 22 calls on Spire uh, those January 22 calls on Spire that Uncle Bruce recommended a while ago are looking very good right now. Rock and roll, kids. Uncle Bruce, my Matterport 1750 calls expire October 15. Is it too early to roll? Um, uh, you're not too early. You're not too late. You're in the sweet spot right now. Uh, this is uh, you know September 3rd. You still have six, seven weeks. Uh, you've got a week or two more of good premium timing to enjoy here, but... Uh, you know, uh, the Matterport, uh, hey, you're in the money now, finally. Thank you. Um, and, uh, you know, if you do roll uh, forward, uh, you know, you're probably going to have to go into 20s. Um, and uh, you may be able to, I don't know how many you have, but you might be able to roll into just as many as you've got if you sell these at whatever price they're trading at and hopefully buy something about the same. Uh, but, uh, hey, uh, another dollar move on the stock is, is, is certainly possible soon ish uh, maybe to the 19 level and that puts you a buck 50 in the money which you know builds your value up and so there you go uh but you're getting to that point where closer to 20 um you know you're gonna look at maybe 20s or you might go for 1750s in the future and have fewer of them but you're still in the money you know lots of lots of options here lots of choice it's nice to have choices like this isn't it uh, Rudy, hi, Uncle Bruce. What fundamentals are driving up Spire and Rocket Lab? I have no fundamentals other than, I think, stock awareness. I think that's what this is. More people be discovering these companies, and as they move, they attract more buyers, uh, and that's what's happening here. Drafting big money has no choice but to buy into the market of infl inflating prices. This should end well. Coyote, Spire just called and said dinner was on them tonight. There you go. Uh, Vapor Rub, should I just leave my ATIP February... Um, 1822 1250 call alone for now uh, um, yeah just 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 sit tight you know just you know you know let, let the company do what they're gonna do uh, you've got time uh, you've seen how stocks can move four or five dollars in a couple of days uh, this one here we're waiting for a new chief executive officer that it's coming they are hiring that person I just get the vibe it's really happening soon because the stock has gone from this 380, 90 range now to 450 in the last two weeks. I kind of get the impression we're 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 getting close to uh, an announcement. Um, uh, we were as low as uh, what was this here? We were as low as 374 on August the 19th. Now we're at September the 3rd and we're at 450. No news. That's how much we've moved in that time frame, and that's telling me yes, we're closing in on a new CEO, and yes, that will be a whole new messenger. And yes, um, market awareness will be priority number one at ATIP. Count on it. Uh, so there you go. Now, if you want to buy some $10 calls for February, forget the 1250s, buy some 10s that are cheap. If they're super cheap, buy them. 
Uh, if you can get some 750 calls super cheap for next February, buy them. Uh, there you go. Now, if only ATFP could get back on its feet. All right, this is wild. Guys, cash your calls first before celebrating. Congrats on all those who are making money today. Realized, of course. Uh, let's see. And, of course, you can all decide, you know, all of you uh, with 27 minutes to go. You can decide right now to cash in all your calls on everything you're up on and sit on the money over the weekend, the long weekend. Wait until Tuesday or Wednesday to see the direction of the market. Maybe some of these shares will consolidate a little bit. Maybe they won't. And then you'll position yourself back in. It's totally up to you. It's a question of what kind of chutzpah have you got? How much uh, How much in the gut have you got? Uh, up to you. Uh, if you've got long-term call contracts, you don't have to do anything. But on the other hand, if, uh, you know, you think Spire might back off a little bit, you might, you know, you might move elsewhere. Now, if Albert, uh, my favorite nephew, thank you for your donation on PayPal. I just saw that pop through. Thank you. That's awful generous of you. I appreciate it. Again, it's all up to you, folks. Uh, Island Girl, then I thought right would be a fancy coincidence. Two blue bangle members have the same birthday. Um, it's not dropping a deuce. It's now dropping an A tip. Uh, if only Aspire had 10 million volume. Thanks, Bruce. Uh, Roach Hunter, you got it, man. AB, uh, um, February, you mean on Spire? Still no January. Uh, fair enough. Um, fair enough. If it's if it's February, it's February. Uncle Bruce, thoughts on writing covered call on Rocket Lab? Premiums are quite juicy for September, October. Price 15 on Rocket Lab. Yeah, I can see that, but um, I don't know if that's what you want to be doing right now. Um, 239 gain today. Um, what if we have a two dollar gain tomorrow, Tuesday? 16 bucks a share. Um, you know, we have a a two dollar gain and, and a couple of flat days and another two dollar gain. You're at 18. You're you know now you're doing rollover games. Um, you may want to just ride this wave. Thanks, Uncle B. Says Cheryl, you got it, Cheryl. So nice to see this. Hope everyone is crushing it. I hope so too. My ATIP call jumped 800 percent today to eight bucks. I am laughing. Okay, that doesn't make sense. Uncle Bruce, when will we see SoFi hit 25 and beyond? I wish I could tell you it, minute to minute. Don't have the answer to that one right now. I am on the wrong boats to enjoy this rising tide with you all. Dang. AB ATIP might see 10 bucks again relatively soon after the new CEO. You think? No, not relatively soon. Uh, that I wouldn't call for, but uh, I would say you're going to see a dramatic change in uh, promotion of the stock. Uh, there could be a brand new team of people in the investor relations department bringing out weekly announcements, just like Matterport does. Really aggressive, up-to-date stuff, and um, deals could be announced fairly quickly, new financing money coming in. And that will get us into the seven, eight level for a while, and then it'll build from there. But then you never know. Um, you never know uh, with these deals. Uh, they're one one merger away from going to fifteen dollars a share. But you know, am I have I got the idea on my hand? I don't know. They don't ask me. I don't have an idea for them. So we'll see. AB ATP won't hit 10 for years, says Austin. Uh, I am also on the wrong boats. Take the money, boys and girls. That's what I did. I sold my 22 $10 calls. Uh, going to sit back and catch my breath now, says VOT. Also, let's go. I sold half my Spire, uh, Spire calls at 165 for $1.04 profit. I'll hold all the rest of the seat. You can always do that too, kids. Absolutely. ATIP royalty screw themselves. Uh, hey, uh, Mike, uh, 9 million volume on Rocket Lab. Me, C, Green. Me, Green again, says Austin. Matterport, 18. That would be great. 17.99 right now. 13.82 on Rocket Lab, up 219. 15.22 on SoFi. We're down to 23 minutes to go. The, uh, the uh, GameStop is 203.90. Matterport at $18. ME is up a nickel. Uh, Smart Rent up 168 to 14.19. Now up 170. Spire 1150 up 232. ATIP uh, unchanged. Uh, sent, uh, Six Terra up 23 cents to 935. A little better there. Um, we've got IBM down 34 cents. The Dow down 34. SP up two. NASDAQ up 38. Uh, that's where we're at right now. Spire drops a buck. Did y'all take profit? Spire will move like this now. It is a volatile mover. Uh, what can I say? It's rolling. Thank you. Krishna, uh, for your donation on PayPal. Thank you. I just I saw that one pop in. Thank you so much. You guys are awesome. I love you guys. Uh, Jen will be pleased. 
SVT Boxer, thumbs up for you, man. Uh, my Spire, 1250 September 17 calls were up 3,300% today. SVT, my $90 um, Jan 21 uh, Royal Caribbean puts looking nice right now. Beautiful. Bruce, thoughts on ATIP calls? $10 for December 22 at 55 cents. There you go. Um, yes, December, yeah, but can you go further out maybe? Uh, that might be an even better deal. Uh, might be an even better deal. MTR, MTTR Matterport, it did touch 18. Am I broken it? 1797 right now is where I see us at right at the moment. Right on. Uh, my 601 shares of Matterport are a nice long hole here. Uncle B, you haven't made any recommendations recently. Should be expecting anything soon. Uh, don't be surprised if at any time you get an alert in your uh, in your membership box. You know, those of you who are members of this channel, don't be surprised if you get a uh, an update uh, anytime. Um, I don't expect one tonight. <laughs> I'm going to be busy th this weekend. I'm moving next weekend, uh, so uh, bear with me. But uh, yeah, don't be surprised when I come up with another one. And you'll have a couple of days advance warning of what's going on, and uh, you can make some moves before the rest of the channel finds out what we're doing. Absolutely. Matterport at 18. Rudy, let's cash in our current place first. Uh, I say get while the getting is good. Strike while the iron is hot. Regroup this lovely Labor Day weekend and come back next week fresh and fierce. Smirko. Hi, Uncle B. Just bought my second call on Goldman Sachs, 360, June 22. Uh, next time, hopefully on Tuesday, I can write a covered call. Goldman Sachs strike, 425 30, September 17. Thanks for all you do. Right on, man. Right on. Beautiful job. That's a poor man covered call strategy, and I congratulate you on doing this. Would someone please tell SoFi to stop acting like a red headed stepchild? <laughs> oh, gosh. Uh, T, hey, Brucey, my first ever serious stock question. First time for everything. I have two $10 Rocket Lab calls expiring October 15. Cost base is 309. Now they're 873. Thoughts on selling one or seeing what Tuesday brings? There you go. Well, um, you know, Rocket Lab now has had this uh, this great month. I mean, look at look, this is the last 30 days for Rocket Lab. Okay, let's take a look at the last week. This is the last week for Rocket Lab. All right. Uh, this is the th this is three months for Rocket Lab. Look, look at that right over there. Zzz, right there. Not bad, huh? Um, so you've got a major breakout happening here. Major breakout. Uh, this isn't, uh, with 9 million shares traded, this isn't like uh, uh, kiddie play here. This isn't children playing with stock. This is serious stuff. This is really good serious stuff. Um, I think you sit tight. Uh, you might not want to give these up. Right. You've got till October, so you have plenty of time. Um, you get another couple of bucks from here. And you got these ten dollar contracts sitting at six bucks a piece, uh, six fifty. That's a thirteen hundred dollar uh, uh, value for two contracts. Not bad at all, and it's entirely likely. I mean, it looks really good. Rocket Lab has no limit on its upside. Uh, a twenty dollar move from here, you know, to twenty dollars would still be unsurprising to me. But you know, right now it's thirteen seventy seven, and it's got to get to fifteen and sixteen and seventeen. But it's tempting to want to sell here, uh, one or both. On the other hand, you got to just sit back and say, even if on Tuesday it backs off a little bit, that could be a temporary little lull, and then we get another shot. On the other hand, we might open up a buck fifty Tuesday morning, then back off a dollar, then go up two dollars from there. Uh, anything is possible, but the Rocket Lab volume coming into this stock is relentless, and I think it's going to get more pronounced. Because nine million today could mean fifteen million on Tuesday or twenty million on Wednesday, and on and on we go, and that will run this thing even higher. There is no resistance to the upside on this stock, so enjoy this and ride it. You've earned it. Um, you deserve it. And um, do a Warren Buffett if you want. Just fold your arms and sit back and watch this thing run along. Anyway, there you go. Uh, ATIP nursing will be outsourced to hospitals to handle demand. Uh, what did ATIP do that was so bad? ME getting volume towards the close. Not a, not bad a lot, but it's relative to the last few hours. We've got 18 minutes to go. Rocket Lab 1360, SoFi 1523, GameStop 20265 down 1087. Matterport 18. ME up six to eight ninety five. Smart rent fourteen sixteen up a buck sixty seven. Spire eleven sixty six up two forty eight. ATI 
P physical therapy up a penny and a half. Six Terra up 14 cents. We got green all over the place here, except for GameStop today. No complaints. Uh, let's keep it going. Uh, let's go, Game M E, please. Uh, low volume on the day, but I thought options were being scooped up today, right? And that's what seems to be going on. This is a good sign. People are coming in here. Um, let's see. Um, and the hospitals are begging to delay elective surgery, and people think the virus will be bad this winter. Keep that in mind on ATIP calls. Go, M-E, go. SoFi is a, in the red-headed stepchild. It, it is the red-headed. Not looking good for beer bongs. Uncle Bruce, any info on GameStop? Corey report, no info. Really hurting the bong chances. Whoops, uh, sing, uh, zing. Uh, sell one, uh, Mr. T. We all have been burnt by not taking profits. I'm so heavy on SoFi. My next child's name will be SoFi. Um, SLGC, uh, high, a quick hi, Bruce, uh, uh, from Sharon. I won't be around tonight, and Monday night is uh, uh, Rasha, uh, Ashana. So I just want to say hi, and won't worry about me. You take care of my love for you. I have a great one, and it's great to see you today. 1804 on Matterport, up 69 cents, climbing. I mean, 896, climbing. Looking good, kids. I uh, love this. Uh, ATIP will suffer under COVID conditions. This channel should be then own most of the SoFi. I think we own all of the SoFi stock. I think we own it. Uh, this channel has uh, millions of SoFi shares. I heard a rumor, Uncle Bruce channel getting picked up by a very big public company. Uh, well, it's news to me. <laughs> oh, that's just me, Michael, saying, uh, well, I miss you at Trivia. Sharon, enjoy the weekend. I have 3,275 shares. Go, baby, go. Larry Titus, thanks. You too. Holding uh, ATIP, going to wait to a new CEO before deciding to dump for more. So if I uh, DM yesterday, there were um, uh, two Rocket Lab uh, posts on uh, Wall Street Bets, uh, Reddit. There were there will <clears throat> there will be uh, F O M O on Tuesday. Uh, only issue is pipe investors, and I don't know what the deal is with that. Well, the shares are looking really good here. Mark um, uh, seems to be a big space stock buy in today. Rocket Labs S P I R. And red wire all up big. It's 4:45 a.m. here, though I'm quite drunk, so you can ignore me. <laughs> yes, they will miss you tonight, Sharon. Uh, Anti PC, uh, and I have been scooping up all the sub $10 Rocket Lab shares and calls the past few weeks, knowing this day would come, and it's only going higher. There you go, kids. There it is. What can I say? Um, fun, fun, fun. Uh, Pete Nigerian and Josh Brown on NBC. Final trade, CNBC Funder recommended SoFi and Matterport yesterday. Don't think much about CNBC, but more attention is coming to those stocks if they're being featured on CNBC. If if uh, Pete Najarian is talking about them, that's the options market. Josh Brown has been consistently talking about uh, Matterport consistently, uh, but maybe now SoFi too. This is good. SVT has 3,000 SoFi shares. Woohoo! NTPC, way to go. Matterport, 1802. Go, baby. Mr. T, thank you for this donation. Brucey, cheers. Best of luck with the move to both of you. Thank you, man. I appreciate that. The moving fund is growing. Scott, <clears throat> hey, Bruce, uh, <clears throat> I'm all out of dry powder, and I don't want to sell covered calls. Anything else I can do to take advantage of this party? Uh, not really. Uh, if you're riding the wave, you're riding the wave. Keep her going. Bertie, uh, T.O. whispered about SoFi, your favorite nephew. Uh, thank you. Uh, we're up, uh, that's another donation. Thank you very much. It's going to go higher. Right on. I have the rest, said, said Cheddar Stacks. Uh, sell puts, says Scott Brewer, if you need to do something. Is Rocket Lab a good stock for covered calls? Uh, not yet, but it's going to be. Uh, I am uh, in the SoFi float. I have so much SoFi, it's not even funny. Uh, uh, let's see. DQ, thanks for the advice. Picked up another 200 shares today. 7,400 total. Beautiful. Bagel Holdings uh, is buying the channel and the house. Um, I have another... I have another account with 30 Matterport in it. Um, considering enabling options trading on it, selling those and buying an Apple call for January at 500, 600 ish. What are your thoughts? Uh, not sure about 500, 600. Is that's the cost of the option? That's not the value of the options. Not sure what's going on. Fair again, if this was a parade, we we'd own the float. FOMO, fear of missing out. Thank you. A flesh infection. Where 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 are my undead homies with? Hundred shares of shallow rotten pocket. I don't know what this means. Uh, I I sold a few GameStop 150 puts for January. I wrote a couple 150 puts for January. That's that's good stuff. That's good stuff. And again, uh, Island Girl, thank you. Um, 
Uh, if Auntie doesn't work for Rocket Lab Investor Relations, then she sure should be. Uh, uh, Auntie, um, uh, so far I have ten. I have ten contracts and one hundred shares. I'm with you, Flesh Infection. Um, high premium equals low. Let stock price if it gets called to buy shares. Oh yes, vapor up good premiums. Uh, today is the type of day we miss Yoko. We need Yoko. She's in a box. Yoko is in a box. A sell ten September. Uh, covered calls. Uh, holiday next week. Only four days of trading. Burn an extra day the, uh, on Monday. Anti PC. Anyone noticed that since Bruce packed Yoko away, the market has been going green? Has anyone noticed that? Has anyone been paying attention? Yoko is in the box, and we're getting richer. Uh, anybody? Anyone? Um, Sharon, you are welcome. We have the same name. Uh, price of option. I think 165 calls are about five to six hundred contracts. I got you. I got you. There you go. You got a point there, Anti PC. Bullish on SoFi. There you go. SoFi 1524, Rocket Lab 1347, GameStop 20271 down 1081, Matterport 18 bucks, ME at 896 up 7, Smart Rent up $1.73 to 1422, Spire 1174 up 256 today, ATIP up 2.5 cents to 454, uh, Sextera up 17 cents to 929. We're coming into the last 10, 11 minutes of the day. Uh, AMC down 47, Robinhood down 98, Vanek Vectors up 221, The Home Depot up 287, IBM down a quarter, uh, Dow down 54, Microsoft down 13, Apple up 68 cents, Tesla down a dollar 65, Bed Bath and Beyond down 71 cents, falling, BlackBerry down 15 cents, Royal Caribbean down 356 right now, um, uh, Norwegian down 85, Carnival down a buck, Goldman uh, Sachs down 231, a bargoon right there. Beautiful. Uh, Amazon up 280. Facebook up 47 cents. Google up 10 bucks. That's where we're at here. Uh, what an interesting day. Uh, amazing day today. And I'm glad to see some of these stocks really take a run for you guys. You deserve these gains. You've earned them. You've earned them. A Yoko in Uncle Bruce voice. Leave Yoko alone, says Larry. Leave her alone. Uh, kudos on the speed reading tonight, Brewster. Emmy going to hit nine again. I can feel it. It's coming back. Alexa, play Yoko. Um, I think her swim has Wedbush saying GameStop losses for the quarter report, but then they're saying GameStop target price fifty dollars. Yeah, there you go. You want to believe that? Um, yes, RC, RCL, Titanic, a Royal Caribbean going down. Uh, nobody puts Yoko in a box. Nobody. Uh, howdy, all. Last Friday in Creston, uh, we have to cheer, uh, cheers, and meet the Green Stock Safe Travels new friends. This is the last show. The last ever show on a Friday night from Creston. That is true, because next Friday, I'm driving a truck. Uh, that is correct. This is the last Friday show. Next week, I'll be on Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. I'm off Monday, but I'll be on Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. Next Thursday will be the last ever show from Creston in a very empty house filled with nothing but boxes. Uh, and I thank you all for your support of this channel and helping us with our moving fund. We're getting ready to go. Um, what can I tell you? We're coming into the last, what is it, nine minutes. Uh, so far is the next one to go. Royal Caribbean under 80 is good for our puts. That's right. Uh, not scared of what GameStop. Uh, it should be trading around three a share, though. Royal Caribbean is so trash. I don't get it. So many state, uh, how many they're making on your picks and only a few to bless you, isn't it? So many state how much they're making on your picks and only a few bless you. Oh, I see. Okay. Uh, I have very generous viewers. They really do reward me. Uncle Bruce, you can rename your show to Stock Markets While Traveling with Uncle Bruce. <laughs> Amy, I have an idea for a billion-dollar app. Uh, it's a map of the world that shows you where Yoko Ono is so you can not be there. It's called the No Yoko app, available on iOS and Google Play stores. <laughs> Oh, man. Uh, thanks for making my Alexa play. She who shall not be named. <laughs> right on, guys. Thank you for being here. How many thumbs ups we have now? 205 thumbs ups from you wonderful people. Thank you so much for helping out. If you're able to throw a thumbs up on this channel uh, before this bell goes, that would be great. Thank you, everybody, for helping out. And getting us higher on the uh, thumbs up count, we do love it. Uh, 19 on the downside now, 207 on the uh, on the upside. The thumbs ups are trickling in. 214 here comes some more right now. 1333 on Rocket Lab up a dollar 70. SoFi 1522 up 16. 
GameStop at 202.21 down 11.30. Matterport 17.93 up 53 cents, 58 cents actually. ME up 8, 897. Smart Rent 171 gain 14.20. Spire up 215 to 11.33. ATIP up 3 cents now 455. Sextera up 16 to 928. That's what's going on. AMC making a late run to try to come up here, uh, trying to break even. It's still down 31 cents. Robinhood down 95. There's where we're at here. The Dow down 43 points. S&P is off uh, point five, It's up a half a point. NASDAQ up 31. So it's a mixed uh, mixed day here. Uh, we have 228 thumbs ups. Thank you for bringing them on. They're still coming. I appreciate it. Every little bit is uh, appreciated on the thumbs ups. I think we have to wait for Bruce to sneeze before we say bless you. I'm getting emotional. I will miss that Uncle Bruce background with all those postcards. Well, Mark, there'll be new backgrounds, uh, new backgrounds and new places. And uh, you come traveling with us now. You come traveling with us. We're nomads uh, starting next week. So you can join us as uh, as uh, nomads in name. Um, need a PFE to run. Get the jab. Um, AB, rename the app. No, yo, no. Uh, <laughs> Thumbs up for Bruce. Thank you, Jen. When we when you grab uh, that tiny uncle and put him in his box, put a bagel in there for him to nibble on during the drive. Hey, Bruce, I swore off stocks yesterday at noon. Did I miss anything? No, missing up there. Nothing going on, Joe. Rudy, uh, Uncle Bruce, what do you see happening with Six Terra the next few weeks? Uh, I don't know. It seems to be uh, quiet. We'll see. Um, I know they were doing show and tells a couple weeks ago. I wonder if we're going to do some more. There's two thumbs up for you. Thank you, John. Uh, Rudy knows about it yet. Uh, Marge and Call says, my name, Jonas. Ring, ring. Uh, is that uh, Marge and Calling? Oops, uh, that's not a thumb. Is that a picture of you and Jen behind you, Bruce? Uh, no, uh, no. These are pictures here. These are no, Those are pictures here of uh, viewers of mine from TWB. Uh, Chicago Transit Minority, um, $25 bonus. Money Moves, thank you for the $25 uh, donation today. I do appreciate all of you who have been donating today. You guys are great. Uh, these PayPal donations are just uh, awesome. Thank you so much, guys. You're really helping us out here. On your right, Uncle Bruce, you you, you guys still have a rotary phone. Uh, no, Jen's cell phone sounds like one. Uh, please put all phones on mute, please. On air, laugh out loud. About to break five digits up. What is going on? SVT is saying, Bruce, are you rebranding the channel to Traveling with Stock Markets with Bruce? No. Uh, Chicago, that's the way. Ring, ring, a banana phone. Uh, Michael, sitting on 10 uh, covered calls, 10 calls for January 22 on Sextera. Sitting on 10 calls for, uh, at uh, Sextera. SVT, that's the way. Market closing in five minutes. Bearish on ATIP. I have same ring on my iPhone. Uh, we got Rocket Lab at 13.44, up a dollar 81. We got SoFi up 14 cents to 15.20. GameStop 2.0202, down 11.50. Matterport up 59 to 17.94. ME up a nickel 8.94. Smart Rent up 166 to 14.16. Spire up 2.48, 11.66. ATIP up a nickel 4.57. Sextair up 13. 925. Got a good day going on all those former SPACs of ours. IBM down 41 cents, Dow down 71. So the Dow is against us. Everything else is rolling. Uh, we're still up on the NASDAQ. We're down three points on SP. Oil down 73 cents a barrel. What a run on a Friday before a long weekend. I think we're going to have ourselves a good day here. I think it'll be just fine, Rudy, says Mike. Um, AB, in, in a sense, it's kind of a mute point now not to own 100. Uh, shares relating to my selling 30 Matterport and buying an Apple call. Ideally, you want to own stock the right calls. If you can't, buy calls, right? Yes, uh, definitely. You buy the right calls. You'll do all right. Then you can afford to buy shares, all right? Traveling stocks and bagel talks with Bruce. <laughs> Thanks, damn it, Jim. Wife and I had Taco Bell for the first time in almost a year. Might need a few minutes to go take a nap. <laughs> Yowza, uh, SVT Boxer sold a call on GameStop for nine cents. Way out of the money. Haha, <laughs> so funny. Uh, hey, I got nine bucks, man. Uh, Gayote, ten dollars for me. Uh, thank you. Happy Labor Day weekend, everybody. Thanks, Uncle B. Thank you, Gayote, for your donation today. All of you helping out today. A uh, spider, uh, Rudy Spire uh, was getting the same type of volume as S Y X T C Y X T until today. Um, a B uh, or sell puts. Uh, Spire, big jump before the bell. Uh, Mike, uh, Michael, thanks, Mike. Appreciate it, Rudy. Uh, right on, guys. Thank you. I've caught up with all your comments. We are two minutes away from the bell, and we're coming into the very end of it. 
Matterport at 17.95, uh, Smart Red 14.16, and uh, Spire 11.96. What a day on Spire today! The high today 12.84. About an hour ago, that was a crazy run, but we're right back up. We've got down to like 11.60 now, we're 11.87 at the end, coming on. Amazing. 1.2 million finally on Spire. Got some volume here, waking up somebody. It was pretty quiet here. Uh, what a day. Uh, let's see, if ATFE is in the, is the, is the, I'm still the buyer. I don't know what that means. Double profit on Spire calls. This is how we do it, people. Absolutely right. Get ready for this. Get used to more of this. I think we're going to see more of this from time to time. Um, uh, days where your shares will not gain pennies but dollars. And uh, that will turn into thousands of dollars for you guys on a daily basis of returns. And uh, that's why, is that why you're here? That's why you watch the classes. Uh, watch the classes, the lessons to learn how to write contracts, how to buy contracts, how to be aggressive, how to write puts. Uh, all the all the tricks, the spreads, everything else, um, you will learn um, bit by bit. SVT, thank you for this donation. Uh, Jens Toft Flaxcard, thank you for your donation on PayPal. Very kind of you. Thank you, SVT. Thank you for this donation too. Everyone be safe this weekend. If you need help, get call Uber. Uh, Don went scooped up a few ME750 calls. October 15, buck 73. I hope it goes well. Gasp. Uh, ME and XYT are going to be the next one to take a run. I'm a .07 from green for the day. Thanks a lot. Right on, guys. Uh, way to go. We're coming into the bell right now. The last minute is happening as I speak. And let's see how we do it. Uh, I still can't believe I asked a serious question of this guy. Jeez. I have yet to have a butterfly spread work out, says DQ. Uh, thanks for preaching patience, Uncle Bruce. My stocks are starting to make me happy. Enjoy the holiday, everybody. Uh, T, are you okay, Mr. T? Uh, Island Girl, happy, happy early birthday to you. Bertie, uh, here's a donation, Bruce. Have a great weekend, Bagel family. Be safe on your travels. Tio, thank you, everybody. Larry, congrats on the green week, everybody. The bells are ringing right now. The market is closed up. We're raking it in, hopefully making money this week. We're back at it next Tuesday. Green, it, we will be. Ding, ding, ding. Yes, indeed. We'll be back at it yet again. We are closed for the day. Uh, let's see where we end up on it all. Uh, watching the final numbers come through here. Thank you, everybody, for uh, your uh, your participation on this market. Uh, thank you, uh, those of you making donations here on PayPal. Um, Alberta Avalese, Av Av thank you so much. Um, thank you, uh, from uh, from uh, who we got here, uh, Krishna. Thank you for that donation of yours, and also from uh, Jens Toft Flagscatter. Thank you for your donation today on PayPal. Uh, those have come through so far. Thank you all uh, very very much for these uh, for these. We're it's helping us uh, uh, rent the U-Haul and get the labor. We got people helping out. We're helping pay us. We're paying them to help us carry, and uh, we're working it. We're working it. Thank you, everybody, so much for your uh, for your uh, donations. And uh, just get richer, please, everybody. Just would you just get richer? I'd really like that. Oh yeah, what a week! SVT says Island Girl. Thanks, Fenville. I was born on Labor Day. Mr. T. Mike was just kidding, buddy. Since I usually contribute nothing but silliness to this channel. Awesome. So much for the beer bongs. Might do them anyways. Um, <laughs> Uh, smoke uh, three dog um, uh, have a great Labor Day thank you for the donation thank you uh, Austin used to be good at those AB we all need now what we need now is a mother of all short squeezes on GameStop and the aftermarket to make the day complete but that ain't gonna happen as much as I'd like it to uh, I live with my mother working all my life to keep the house uh, family first says DraftKing right on have a great weekend Uncle B thank you uh, Bertie uh, thumbs ups here Mike T, yes, I was as well. I know you well. Later, everybody. Thanks, guys. Uh, good man. What am I going to do on Monday? Uh, I only wish I were much younger when I had the guts to invest in the stock market. Uh, what can I say? Uh, $74, or 74 point drop on the Dow final count. Uh, S&P down 1.4. NASDAQ down uh, up 32. Uh, oil down 72 cents. Uh, we got the smart rent aftermarket. Up a dollar. No, Smart Rent today closed at 14.05. Excuse me. Uh, nice day today for Smart Rent. Uh, 14.05 close. Uh, beautiful. SoFi closed at 15.16 today. Now 15.18 in the aftermarket. We have NASDAQ finishing higher, but the S&P 500 and Dow fall after the jobs report today. Final counts there. SoFi 15.17 right now. 
Matterport closed at 1796 today. Uh, nothing in the aftermarket from what I can tell you. GameStop 202 uh, on the day, 202.67 or 202.45 in the aftermarket. Um, and ATIP closed at 452 on the market. We're now 454 in the aftermarket. It looks like a little higher, I think. Uh, <clears throat> what else? We got Apple closing at 154.30 uh, and we're at 154.29 on the, the aftermarket. aftermarket. There's what we got. Uh, thank you, everybody, for uh, for uh, being here. Um, let's see. Picked up some more GameStop on this dip. Enough is never enough. Um, and uh, let's see. Going to see what happens next week. Uh, brings Looking at SoFi probably for some more averaging down. Um, after a day like this, we can all afford Uncle Bruce's classes. Uh, there you go. Good idea for the long weekend. Dust up and learn some info there. I uh, guess I'm a loser, says DraftKing, um, or a better man than I thought, and I know beer bongs. ATIP in the money, uh, 250, uh, December 22 calls at 240 per. The fives are 145. Are these too far out, Uncle B? Their management debacle makes me want to go way out there. That's the thing. Further out, the better. But uh, 250s, you should be safe. I would think so because you're in the money now, and I think you're going to be more in the money. The question is by how far. Look at look at this graph chart. Before all gone, have a good long weekend, everybody from Splair. Cheddar Stacks missed the close. Had to teach a noob how to change his thermostat. Austin doing a diet do and gin instead. Wouldn't recommend it. <laughs> I should have worked two jobs. Ab says I could be employed. Uh, Sharon, uh, Sharon uh, Chapman. Thank you, Sharon, for your donation. Love you. You are too kind. I should have worked two jobs the minute I could be employed. And dumped it all into Apple stock while in high school. Laugh out loud. I said I bought baggy jeans, limp biscuit CDs, and PlayStation games. Oops. <laughs> uh, DQ Draft King, taking care of your mother doesn't make you a loser. Uh, yes, that sounds awful, Austin. Uh, no bongs today. Um, Biden, SoFi trading six times more volume than Matterport. Yet Matterport outperforming SoFi, right? Well, there's more shares outstanding on SoFi. Uh, yeah, that's it. Uh, Sharon, best of luck with the move. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, dear. Boxes galore. Uh, Jen and I made up a whole bunch of boxes this afternoon. There's more ready to roll here, and we'll be packing all weekend. Getting it all set up, and uh, next week, panic packing, dump runs. We have a cat to uh, get rid of. We have a cat to uh, find a new home for. We're working on that right now. Um, and uh, we got stuff going on. Fenneville, goodbye, Uncle B. Have fun moving over the weekend, sir. Uh, it's next week. We move next week. This weekend is packing weekend. It's just packing. Michael, ha, huh? that guy's name uh, gets me every time. Um, Wally's World, <clears throat> thanks, Uncle Bruce. Have a good weekend. Take breaks and drink lots of water. Don't lift anything over your limit. See you next Tuesday. Going to be fun. Wally, as always, my man, you are the best. Have a great long weekend yourself. Keep making money and Let's see where these stocks go. I love the green on all these SPAC stocks. I know a bunch of you are long the stocks. You're patiently waiting, and you're getting rewarded. It's about time. Uh, DQ, uh, AB, you did it all for the rook, for the nookie. Uh, can I buy those uh, Limp Biscuit CDs? Alexa, play Limp Biscuit. <laughs> Number four, my wife's cousin stole them all. He looked like Fred Durst, too, laughing out loud. Fergan, see you next Tuesday. Never mind. Um, uh, have a nice weekend, y'all. Thank you, Dewin. Joshua, make sure the new cat owner uses only chewy products. KW, have a great weekend. Michael, AB, used to wear UFOs like not size, like nine sizes too big. Limp Biscuit wrote a song about options. Keep rolling, rolling, and rolling. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure they did. I'm sure that's what it was all about. I'm sure of it. Yes, I'm sure that's what they were doing. Z 7 1796, last trade on Matterport uh, today. Um, right on, Matterport. Thank you for a good week. We had a very good week this week on Matterport. Uh, we were down in the 15 level early part of the week, and now we're up into the 18 level. Uh, the last month, uh, as low as 14 on Matterport, now 18, best level in months. Love it. Broke out. We've got breakouts happening all over the place. JNCOs, I had like 10 pair. Uh, I've, I have moved a lot of my life. Thankfully, our move was always paid for by my husband's company. It was overwhelming. Michael, it's 90 style, Bruce. Uh, yippee ki -yay. Hope your move is easy with no uh, hang-ups or pulled muscles. Uh, nice AB. Uh, yes, about time. I can't believe it's Labor Day weekend already. Summer went by way too fast. I hate the cold. They still make JNCOs, but about 100 bucks a pair, though. Oh, my gosh. 
I'm hoping this 90s theme continues into Trivia Hour. Uh, <laughs> yep, we'll be on tonight, 7 o'clock Eastern Time for Trivia. If you want to join us as a member, you're welcome to come on over. Uh, we're on this channel and on TWB. They were like 50 to 80 bucks back then, too. Oh, my God. Gin and diet do. I'm not a hillbilly, though. A DQ, I guess uh, it's true what they say. The August market sucks. <laughs> there you go. Fun times at the OK Corral, kids. Uh, we're trying to stay on top of these markets, make some returns on uh, on these uh, investments, and we're finally getting some payouts. Now we just have to you know, wait out the big ones, the big payouts, as they keep bringing it in. Yeah, um, my parents wouldn't buy them because of the price. Doc Martens are over 300 now. My 12-year-old just asked me for a pair. Yikes. Yikes. Uh, thank you, parents, every day, please. Oh, man, thank your parents every day, says Mike. Wow, uh, the yikes indeed. Cheers, everybody, uh, from around the world here on the channel. Thank you for joining me this week and, uh, and all day today for the two shows we put up. We'll be up on trivia a little later tonight. Will Trevi be on politics? I hope not. Just went and looked at my bounty from today, and wow, not too shabby. Number four, Mad TV will uh, sasso Limp Biscuit. <laughs> okay. Uh, I'm not sure what that means, but I don't think I have to worry about that. Uh, okay. Rocket Lab is up in the after hours. 1370 now. Uh, moving higher. Um, another 18 cents on the after hours. Gotta love that. Go Rocket Lab. Um, RK is it RKLB? Uh, yep, RKLB is the symbol. And uh, Rocket Lab right now, thirteen seventy up eighteen cents on four thousand one hundred shares. Doesn't take much to move this market, does it? Does not. Um, <clears throat> thank you. Um, uh, hey Bruce, I'm checking uh, in from New Orleans. Uh, Excuse me, this is the first time um, uh, I've had solid cellular connection all week. Still no power, though. Wow. <clears throat> yeah, it's rough down there. They warned it. They warned everybody how bad it was going to be, um, and the power uh, was sus suspect. Could not hold it. Incredible. You see that laughing out loud. So, John, got to run. Best of luck packing this weekend. SLG Sharon, take care. I hope you laughed at your 12-year-old um, island girl. Gave her some what you were willing to pay and ask him to fork over the rest. He has a savings. Larry, I miss Mad TV parody music videos. Joshua, Uncle Bruce should come on with face paint like Wes Borland from Limp Biscuit. I wish my kid would come back and ask me for some $300 shoes. I laugh a lot. I feel bad because I love my pair from my teens. Wow, $300. I think I still have my Doc Martens from years ago. Hope all is well with you, uh, Aaron, uh, Island Girl, saying, Auntie, I don't even pay that much for my own shoes. Uh, neither do I. Uh, no, I, I don't pay that much for my shoes either. Um, wow, 1370 on Rocket Lab. Thank you very much, Rocket Lab. Keep right on going and make my viewers richer, please. That would be just loverly. Uh, Matterport, 1796 on the market, 1796 on the aftermarket. There you go. Uh, okay, there it is. Uh, Smart Rent, 1405 on the market. No aftermarket trading right now. Spire, 1193, 1156 in the aftermarket. Try to make sense of that. Um, and the ATIP closed at 454. So right on, guys. Uh, not a bad not a bad week, wouldn't you say? Uh, good day today. Dress shoes, $1,000. Sneakers, 50 bucks. I found a pair of similar for like 150 or so. I'm hoping she's cool with that. Well, you'll find out uh, sooner or later. You'll know. All righty, kids, I'm going to call it a day. I'm going to call it a week for uh, stock market um, info. I'm going to get ready now for trivia. we got a few questions to line up for trivia yet. So we're going to shut this show down and say thank you, everybody, for uh, participating with me yesterday, the, all this week, this morning, today, this afternoon. hope to see you at 7 o'clock tonight for trivia if you want to join in. Uh, yep, kids don't know the value of hard-earned money. Uh, yo, 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 says Carter. Uh, I bought myself two pairs of shoes in the last five years. My mom lives in Pearl River. Uh, she just got power back today. Number four, four dollars for Italian dress shoes at Goodwill. Carter Cole, I wonder when my membership will lapse. Uh, just wait till your kids want you to buy them a car. Take care, Bruce and all. Thank you, Michael. Uh, laugh out loud. Spire falling off a cliff in the aftermarket. Thank you, Uncle B. Uh, have a great weekend. Get get your likes in. Everybody, have a great weekend. Uh, hope the weekend full of friends, family, lots of booze. Labor Day, my American compatriots. Joanne, glad I sold half my calls. Way to go, you guys. 
Uh, thanks, Uncle B. Uncle B. Bruce, you care? Take care. Final Crest and Friday. This is it. Final Crest and Friday. I uh, have a safe weekend, everybody. See you all Tuesday morning. We're out of here next Friday in the truck, driving out. Uh, so, guys, thank you all. I will see you Tuesday morning. Uh, I will be three days from now, Tuesday at eight thirty for the next stock show. But I'll see you at seven o'clock Eastern if you want to join me for trivia tonight. Come on by. Have a good Labor Day weekend, everybody. See you Tuesday, Uncle B. Uh, thank you all. I'll see you Tuesday. Oh, okay. I'm going to try to make trivia right on. Check out the lessons in the meantime on the channel, on the website, stockmarketswithbruce.ca. And thank you all for your support today. All right, guys. I'll catch you later. Take care. Bye for now from Creston. See you on Tuesday on this uh, stock channel. Uh, otherwise, we'll see you later tonight. We'll be good trivia tonight, says Andy. This makes everyone get a Labor Day with a smile on our faces. That's right, Baba Babe. You know it. We're smiling now. See you later, guys.